Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is John F. Keys. In this video, I'll teach you how to improve your worship course on keyboard, part 8. I'll be using this song. God is able to do just what he said he will do. He's gonna fulfill. I hope you know this song, right? Okay, I'll go ahead and play it as an interlude. After some seconds, I'll pause it and break it down for you. Let's get started. Alright, let me stop here. I'll be teaching from the key of F major. I'll be using this key for general understanding. So the basic chord progression of this song is 1, 5, 6, 4. So that is just it. Okay, so what I was holding on my right is five, one, two, three, five, one, two, three, five, one, two, three. All right. So that is what I had on my right. Five, one, two, three. Then my left. One, 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 one. Do, do. So this is just your octave. So if you don't know much about octave, I'll be attaching a link on my description. All right. Yeah, I talked more and discussed about octave. So Definitely, you understand better. So, I heard my octave. So, that's for the one. Now, for the five, which is your saw. On my right, I heard five, seven, two, five, seven, two. Right? Five, seven, two. Okay? Then, for my left, for saw, I heard five, seven, five, seven, five, seven. Which is your sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, no, five two, five two, five two. Sorry for that. Five two. Okay, yeah. So which is your sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, yeah. So when you hold it together, this is how it's going to sound. Note for the right, you hold your five seven two. Then for the left, five two or oh, sorry. Now for the la. Okay. So on my right, I had six one three six one three six one three, which is your la do mi la do mi. I'm using number pattern and turning so far to explain at the same time for general understanding. Okay, so six one three la do mi. All right, for the left you hold la mi la mi la mi or six three six three. Okay, so just worry, say he will do. Now for the four, this is what I heard. For my right, I heard five six one, five six one, which is your solado, solado. For the right, okay. Now for the left, I heard four one, four one, four one, four one. Okay, yeah, which is your fado, fado, fado. All right, on the right, if you choose to play the normal four, which is your four, six, one, no problem, but I prefer to play five, six, five, six, one. Okay, which is your so, la, do, just for this song. All right, so when you hold it together with the left and the right, it will sound like this. But if you play the normal uh, four, to sound like this. But this one will sound okay. So I prefer to use it for this song. Now, God is able to do just what He said He will do. Yeah, I play something like that. So this is just Family Redo, Family Redo, Family Redo. 
So it is also your four three two one. Four three two one. Okay. So the finger approach matters. So for the right, I played it as an octave. As an octave. For the left, I only played it as a single note. Okay. Now when you add the boat, it will sound like this. So for the right as an octave, for the left, you just play it as a single note. So Alright, so playing this thing will make your piano not to be boring, alright? Yeah, and it will help cover some gaps. So from the beginning. God is a Alright. Every prayer that Alright. So at this point progression changed. So this is where the progression changed. So this is just a uh, The finger approach is still the same. The right to play it as an octave, while the left to play it as a single note. All right, so four, three, four, five. For the five, you still land it as octave. Then you come and hold it as a normal triad. Okay, so four, three, four, five. All right, so while the left to do, we do. Alright, so don't give up on cause he will be so this so this is just my C sharp minor. Alright? C sharp minor. Okay, so this is your C sharp major. Alright, then this is the minor. So hold your C sharp. Alright, then hold your E. Then and your G sharp. So C sharp E G sharp. Alright? For the right. Now for the left, you hold your C sharp and G sharp. Alright? C sharp and G sharp. Alright? Yeah. So that is just it. There you can play your normal progression. So from the top. Play a number stone. So, yeah, as simple as that. As simple as that. Remember the progression changed. Don't give up on cause in six, five, four, immediately, all right? So it depends on how the vocalist wants it, all right? The vocalist may not really enter immediately on the second verse. It can sing the first one all over and all over again before. Just be careful of it, all right? So follow the lead singer, then add some of this chord. Definitely it will improve your worship chord, all right? So let me run it down, then I'll call it a tutorial from the top. Can solo. Then you play your normal 
So that is just it on how to improve your worship calls on keyboard part 8. You need to watch the part 7, part 6 and part 5, alright? I'll attach a few of them on the description of this video. Very, very important to watch. So thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel.